Hello everyone, and welcome to an episode of Let's Hide in a Bush with Claudius. Why are we hiding in a bush? Well, we are currently hiding in a bush. Uh, because the last episode of this Let's Play was, to put it in plain terms, the single most excruciatingly, horrifyingly, unbelievably, unprecedentedly, awful episode of this Let's Play to record and play that I have ever experienced. It's, in fact, it's quite possibly the most horrific episode of any Let's Play I've ever done that I've had to uh, record. Words cannot describe the, um, the level of rage and um, frustration um, that I was at by the time um, I stopped recording. Um, not even Dark Souls has managed to get me to a point where I was as angry as I was um, at the end of the last recording session. Hence the previous episode lasting only a grand total of about 18 minutes. So, as a result of this, I have decided to lower the game's difficulty to adept. Previously, it was not. It was on expert. Um, but now, it's worth bearing in mind, in fact, that adept is the recommended difficulty for Skyrim. Um, I upped it to expert originally because I felt like I wasn't being given enough of a challenge from the game in some respects. Um, however. As far as I'm concerned, having a slightly easier time of it is um, infinitely preferable to being one-shot sniped by guards with crossbows um, every time I load a quick save. Guards with crossbows, laser-guided crossbows I might add, fired from about 50 meters away from a guard hiding in a bush that I didn't even see. Um, if I wanted to play Red Orchestra, I would play a Red Orchestra. I wouldn't go into Skyrim and make give my give all the guards OP crossbows. Um, so I've lowered the difficulty to Adept. Um, we shall see exactly how much of an effect this actually has on the game. Hopefully, it will be a significant one, because quite frankly, while I what did want to certainly convey a sense that Claudius was still feeling very out of his depth and that there was an actual point in him joining the companions and learning how to fight like a true warrior and all that sort of thing. Being two-shotted by ice wolves and one-shotted by guards with crossbows was getting to the point where it was almost a bit farcical. Um, it was getting slightly ridiculous and as a player the game was not e the game was actually starting to become um, an incredibly unenjoyable experience to actually play so that's why I've done it um, we'll, we'll see what happens basically um, on adept difficulty in theory there are no additional bonuses and penalties applied to the player or the enemies we should in theory now have a level playing field whether or not I will still get one shotted by crossbows of course remains to be seen um, because of course that was happening um, back at the start of the let's play even on adept difficulty but now obviously we're not level like three anymore and trying to fight bandits that are a higher level than us so hopefully it shouldn't be quite as bad but it was becoming quite silly um, and hopefully the mod should provide still a bit of a challenge um, it shouldn't be to the level where I am um, at a point where I am essentially rage quitting the game so in a minute we're hiding in a bush simply because as soon as I loaded the quick save I dashed over here in sneak mode so that I could actually have a chance to do this opening without getting beset by um, the local rift guard 
garrison. Um, <laughs> Filnia here has probably has been looking at us for the last like five minutes. Like, what on earth is he doing? Reigns is somewhere. There he is. He's got the good sense to sneak as well. <laughs> So what we're going to do first of all is um, I'm going to try and avoid the rift guards entirely, um, if at all possible. I don't, although I don't see exactly how that is going to be possible because there's a great big lake there, and there's guards all the way along here. So we're going to have to go through here one way or the other. <sighs> so we might as well just get on and do it, honestly. If they give us a fight, then I suppose we'll get to see what the difference in difficulty is like. I can see one already up over there on that guard tower. I don't know about the rest, though. There's one over there. Another up in that tower. Now, they won't immediately attack us on sight. They'll try and run over and arrest us. Like this guy's about to do. So... You have committed crimes against Skyrim and her people. What say you in your defense? Go to hell. That's what I say. Oh, dodge that. Ah! Alright. Okay, now we're getting... Oh, shot at. I blocked that shot, but... Drained all my stamina in the process, and apparently I will still get murdered by crossbows even on adept difficulty, folks. Crossbows in Skyrim do take the piss somewhat, do they not? Granted, I wasn't on full health then, but still. This is getting slightly silly. Well... It's getting quite late in the evening as well, which I'm not fond of, honestly. But it looks like we might have to try and figure out an alternate way around here. Because I don't think I want to fight all the rift guards. Crossbows are bad, people. Very bad. Yep, difficulty is in fact on adept. I did did do that correctly. Okay, requires a key. That must be the player home in this city. Honey side. Yeah, it is, isn't it? Do you lads fancy a swim? I don't, but um, it doesn't look like we've got much of a choice. I hope there aren't any guards over by the docks. Uh, oh, yes, there are. There's one running around there right now. In fact, attempting to come over here. Uh oh. In fact, he's going for a swim with the express purpose of coming over here to arrest us, which is actually highly amusing, but... Alright then, come on. You're away from all your friends over here, so... <laughs> yeah, keep coming this way. Sod off, mate. On the bright side, the Rift Guards apparently died much faster on Adept, which I'm totally okay with, to be perfectly honest with you. Anyway, let's level up then. Um, apparently, we want more health, because that seems to be the best defense I have against crossbows, since my arm is useless against them. Um, Shock magic. By age, I can't get that anyway, so that's pointless. Yeah, there's nothing I can see there that can protect against missile attacks. Other than... Maybe. Another reason for me wanting to lower the difficulty as well is so that I can focus on non-combat perks. Um, whereas before, if I stopped putting points into combat perks, I would probably 
find my ass getting kicked pretty handily. Um, for now, I'm going to put an extra point into block. Because we can block crossbow bolts at least. Don't uh, no complaining from you, mate. Sorry, but I saved your ass from those uh, Falmer. I don't want to hear a damn peep from you about how you disapprove of me killing guards that are trying to throw me in the dungeon. So anyway. Still not going around that way. Uh, let's see. Can we get across? No, we are going to have to go for a swim either way here. It looks like. I'm just hoping these guys will follow me across, basically. Looks like they are going to, in a roundabout fashion. Come on, lads. I'll light a campfire, I think, on the other side. We'll dry out so we don't get bloody hypothermia and then... Yeah, we already feel chilly. And then we'll continue on our way to Shorestone. Where I may have to kill all the guards. <laughs> to be quite honest, it depends, honestly. I mean, if they're, if they're Stormcloak guards, they won't attack me on sight. And if that's the case, I will simply change out of my Imperial uniform, I think I've decided. And I will go incognito if it means that I can actually stay there for the night. Alright, come on, chaps. Um, well, I think I've got enough firewood, so... Oops, wrong button. Also wrong button. Build campfire. Placement cancelled. What? Oh. Do we inadvertently bumble into... More guards! Uh oh. Game? Thank you. Almost stabbed Range in the face there, Claudius. Be careful. hitting me with his crossbow, that's kind of funny. I know it's a horrible bug, but it is amusing nonetheless. Oh my god, how many of them are there? They're everywhere. I can't, I can't escape these bastards. Right, sorry viewers, officially any remorse I felt for killing these guys in the first place has completely evaporated by this point. They must all be destroyed as far as I'm concerned now. I probably have more sympathy for Imperial Stormtroopers than this lot. Now I have to do all this all over again. Right now, is the numpty over by the docks going to come over and try to arrest us this time? No, just a different one is. I just want a decency to draw a weapon instead of... My god, I wish... It must be a bug with Immersive Head or something, but I really would appreciate if my health bar would actually pop up when I'm taking damage. Like, big time. Appreciate that. Right. Oh, God. The Gate Longbow? Bloody hell. That's interesting. Where did you nick that from, you you jammy bastard? I'm pretty sure a rift guard doesn't normally carry legate longbows. I don't compare to my I have an orcus shortbow. Damage fifty. It's not that good, is it? I mean it's quite valuable though, mind you. I think I'll take it on those grounds if nothing else. Steel long mace. That's interesting. I'll take the arrows. Right, lads, come on. 
Let's cheese it. Let's go. Time for a swim. If I get one comment about Claudius swimming in full plate armor, I think I'm probably going to murder someone. <laughs> Preferably a Riften guard. Now that I think about it. I am actually, by the way, eating a strepsil right now, if you're wondering why my voice is being a bit strange. It's because I'm sort of eating a strepsil at the same time. I, uh, unfortunately, I would never normally eat while recording an episode of one of my Let's Plays. Um, I really need it just to keep my, my cough and my throat under control right now, so I do apologize. But it's a necessary evil. Now then. My god, there's there's millions of the buggers. Swarms of the sods. Um, oh god, and they're attacking on sight as well, apparently. See, how come I only get to take off, like, a quarter of his health when I hit him with a crossbow, and he gets to take off all mine? It's just not fair, people. It's just not fair. Go get him, Reigns. Don't know what I'd do without you, mate. I really don't. Die a lot, probably. Like that. See what I mean? How does that happen to me? And it doesn't do much to them. I mean, they're wearing lighter armor, I suppose, but... Crossbows only ignore armor. They don't do more damage based on the armor you're wearing. I mean, you know, as in they don't do more damage the heavier your armor is. Somebody help. So... Oh, God, now what? Get over here, you stupid bloody... Okay. Guess I'll swim across the lake. We'll have to wait. My goodness. Hey, buddy, think there was a war on? <laughs> Seriously, though, crossbows, bloody hell. There's got to be a patch out there somewhere that makes these things li less lethal. Because this is just silly. Uh, well, apparently you didn't need my help. I do apologise for this, Reigns. I mean, considering you, you 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 make such a big point of saying how much you hate lawbreakers and everything, but if I, if if it's any consolation whatsoever, I see these guys as being lawbreakers themselves in a way. In joining the storm cloaks. I don't know. I, that's probably a very weak justification, Reigns, but since you're killing these guys quite happily without much complaint, I'm going to assume that you're alright with it. Alright, let's try this again. I'm going to see if we can swim over a bit more to the left, perhaps. Because apparently there's a there's a huge there's a there's a battalion of the bloody guards over by that windmill over in that direction. So I need to level up again. I forgot about that. Let's do that now. There we go. Right then. Uh, guys? Oh, at least you're here. Rain's less of a concern. Blacksmith priority here. Christ, I thought it was a horse then. There you are. Good. Now then. Right, there are these two cretins by the back gate. But I reckon we can take them. The 200,000 over by the windmill, though, that's a different matter. What are you doing, Reigns? Um, I need a clear shot, shot here, dude. Come on. There we go. Someone do something. Use this tree to my maximum advantage.
Oh Christ and a This is just no come on game give me a break Welcome to Let's Die a Lot and Skyrim with with Dave. Episode two, apparently. Somebody help. Oh my God, I didn't get one shotted by a crossbow. I almost got one shotted by a crossbow, but I didn't actually get one shotted by a crossbow. <laughs> to everyone's amazement, I'm sure. Just, just, just freaking hold still. I love how the half-hearted cries of the blacksmith there. Someone do something! Again, I narrowly apparently survived that. Apparently that level up Jake gave me just enough health to survive a crossbow hit. Just. Oh Christ, there he is. See, look how many he can take. It's it's, it's silly. It's unfair and it's silly. I can't believe this is out of difficulty. I just I can't. Forgive me for being somewhat less enthusiastic about Bethesda adding crossbows to the game. No! <sighs> Saw that going before it even happened. Okay, new tactic. Try and close the distance. With these bastards. Well, preferably actually get a sneak attack on one of them before we get started. That's not a guard. Quite honest, I don't see where the guards actually are. Can we just skirt around them like this? Tell you what, guys, at this rate, I'm gonna have to help General Tullius take the rift just so I can enter this area of the map safely again. You know what, I could get a shot on him from here, but I'm not gonna I'm not gonna. I'm gonna try and get past. You are very cold. Yes, I know. I'm sorry. Light a campfire as soon as. Oh no. We were so close as well. Right. Alright, one down. Very satisfying stab to the stomach. Alright, potion time. Okay. Health. Stamina. Oh, so close! <sighs> and the game crashed. Because it felt like it couldn't make my day any worse. And therefore decided to try.
Right, apparently we can't sneak past these guys. So, they've got to die. Okay, there we go. Someone do something. He's nearly dead. Focus on him. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm just going to get crossbowed in a second, aren't I? See him off to my left there. Oh my goodness. Oh, come on. This is just stupid now. give incentive for you to not just go on killing sprees all the time. However, when they become regular enemies on account of our little bounty situation here in the rift, we have problems. In either case, though, I'm still keeping the difficulty on Adept because I have had e-fucking enough of dealing with this crap. So anyway, I reckon we can light a fire here without getting ambushed by rift guards, so let's do that. If I remember how. There we go. Oh, Jesus Christ! This game is having a laugh, I tell you. There's another one nearby, I can hear it. Screw this, fellas, we're moving away. I forgot we were in bear country. Yep, there he is, over there on the road. I guess that's Mummy Bear. Sorry, Mummy Bear, but it's your own stupid cub's fault. And frankly, I have no remorse whatsoever for preventing two more bears from coming into the world. Oh, Christ. Why do I smell bandit? Yep, thought so. There's one right there. I'm warning you. Back off. Well, alright then, I suppose. Actually, you know what? If you guys are going to leave us... No, you bandits. Claudius doesn't like bandits. Claudius would kill bandits. Uh... Oh, wow. That's a nice change of pace. Decapitating people. Oh, thank God for that. Let's 
beginning to wonder if I was even worthy of the title of Dragon Button by this point, honestly, but apparently we're not completely incompetent. Um, excuse me. It's more like it. Loot. Sweet, sweet loot. And you? King, eh? Life of Earth, Laugh at all. Part 4, King. I shall take that. Alright then, I think campfire. Right here, right now. Let's do this. Good stuff. What's the time? 8.36pm. Um, I think we're going to camp here for the night, lads. I really do. I, I think it's a long, long walk to Shaw's Stone from here. Um, particularly considering we're in the wrong, heading com in the completely the wrong direction, actually. Um, yeah, it's a long. It doesn't look like a long walk, but that is going to be such a long walk because there's going to be all sorts in between here and there: rift guards, bears, you know, you name it. Um, so. I think we're going to make camp here for the night. I reckon that's what's going to happen here. Um, right, items. Where's my tent? Large fur tent, that's what we want. Yeah, uh, what do we pitch this bloody thing? Oh, good grief, no. That, those are crossbows. Those are fucking crossbows. That's crossbow bolts. Well, who is it now? Contact magic compass. Tell me where they are. I can see them. I don't know who exactly they are, though. It's more guards, isn't it? Oh, no. It's storm cloaks this time. Was he alone? Apparently he was. A lone scout. I'll take his ale. Alright then. What a waste. You shut up, alright. Who saved you from Falmer? The Imperial officer did. Who just tried to sneak up and kill us? The Stormcloak did. Last from I hear from you, the better, mate. Seriously. Otherwise, I'm going to stab you in the face and damn the companions to hell. Um. Oh, poor Claudius, though. Seriously, like this poor bastard has to suffer so much. Like, I don't think I've ever had a character, certainly not on this channel, and possibly not ever, that has suffered as much as Claudius has. Where the heck can I pitch this bloody thing? That will have to do. It's a bit wonky, but whatever. There we go. But say, tent, could you spawn gourds? Gourds are edible. I thought we'll have them. Well then. Mother of God. Still hungry, eh? Ale? Bit more water, eh? Bit more water. Oh god, no, they're empty. Oh no, oh, I forgot to fill them again, damn it. Uh, well, sorry Claudius, but it looks like you're going to have to go to bed tired, hungry, and thirsty tonight. Like I said, suffering. So very much suffering.